<clears throat> All right, guys, what's going on? It's your boy Larry Wills coming to you live from NBL Business in Orlando Studios, Florida, right? <laughs> and so, uh, man, 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 man. All right, so what today is today? I'm going to talk about traffic, right? I'm gonna give you a bunch of traffic. Because why? Because I am at that point right now in my own company. I'm at the point of traffic. All right. And so with that being said, a lot of people are desperate for traffic. All right. Let me let me explain something to you. Traffic is not going to show up in your life until you have something that traffic wants. (laughs) Okay. And guess what else? People are not going to show up unless you actually start helping people. Right. And so at the point in my business right now, we're at the point where is we're about to start traffic and, and people are at the edge of their rope right now because, you know, we've been building this thing for about six years. We've been in the trenches for a while and building a project for that long. That's the slowest money I've ever made. The fastest money I've ever made is after a product is finished, validated and we put it out to the world of traffic. That's the fastest money I've ever made. That's faster than sales. It's faster than hustling. It's faster than anything that you can ever imagine. And then your life can change in an instant. So so in actuality, success does happen overnight. It just depends on what, what pieces of the puzzle, what formulas that you are using that determines on if your success will be an overnight or not. All right. Now, here's where your discipline comes in at. Money will only show up. Let me let me say let me put this a different way, because we don't understand how it, how it works. All right, and so you're you're operating in two lands. You're either operating in a land of desperation, or you're operating in a land of 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 a formulaic like formulas, right? And so if you you if you're operating in a land of desperation, you're thinking things to yourself like, I need to make more sales, and I need to fix my finances i need to pay my bills i need to do you, you're thinking about all that stuff and i know you're thinking about it because you tell me about it and when you tell me about it that means that that's what you're thinking about 90 percent of the time but when if you just stop the fear of your limiting beliefs meaning now here's a bad day for me you know what a bad day is a bad day is if i don't wake up that's a bad day everything outside of that is a plus Right. <laughs> Everything else out of that is a plus because I'm not reacting to the circumstances that come up. I'm only creating solutions to the problems I face. That's it. Right. And one of those solutions as a beginner is that I had a problem getting leads. I had, a, I had an issue getting leads. So before we get into the traffic stuff that I'm about to teach my team, I'm about to show you some beginner traffic stuff that you can use for yourself right now okay so we're going to talk about two websites real quick we're going to talk about craigslist site called craigslist we're going to talk about site called cora q-u-o-r-a dot com both of dot com on craigslist people come to craigslist so they can search and seek for for the solutions to the problems that they've obtained they're looking for a solution to something that they're going through people go to cora to ask questions about the problems that they have so they're going to cover to ask a question about something that they're facing. Now, here's where you come in at in place. You need an a, a, a offer. You need some type of offer, not valuable content. They don't want to know who you are, how long you've been in business, what you've accomplished. All that is bull crap that you're talking about for no reason. Right. <laughs> and it's and it's leaving you in desperate situations because it's not actually putting an offer in front of a client and say, hey, this is what I got. Do you want it? And if the client want it, here's the money. Let's go in the rock. If you're not doing those things, then you're wasting time. And that's why your finances are broke. You're trying to be an entrepreneur. You're trying to build this extravagant business. You're trying to do this. this you're trying to build this community. You're trying to build this tribes. You're trying to do all this stuff versus do the first thing that you need to learn how to do before you can do anything else. Make one sale. You need to learn how to make one sale. If you can learn how to sell one person, then you can duplicate that to two people, to three people, to four people. But if you can't get a predictable, consistent one sale coming in, how are you supposed to get automated profits coming in? All right. And so this is how I do it. The offer is simple. This is what I have. This is what it can do for you. And this is how you get it. That's, how, that's the offer. This is what I have. 
This is what it based on the problems you face. This is what it can do for you based on the resol- resolution that you want. And this is what I mean, this is how you can get it. If you haven't wrote that out and given it to somebody in that format, then that's why you aren't making any money. All right. And if you and and if you don't know how to do that, that means that your foundation isn't properly set up. Of course, I don't have time to teach you how to set up a foundation, but we have a wonderful product and MBL business with that situation. All right. So if you are a beginner, don't have a foundation, you need a, a person that's going to be a mentor to tell you how to put up a foundation. You don't need to go and spend 33,000 years learning foundation material because you're still going to be confused. OK, the second step is that once you learn how to put together your foundation, that means that you got a valid uh, offer that you can see if you can validate it. So what you the first thing you want to do is you're going to go to Cora dot com, the site where people ask questions based on the problem that they have. You want to type in the keyword to whatever you're selling, to whatever you're pitching. So if you're pitching marketing, you want to type in marketing. If you pitch an affiliate stuff, you want to type in affiliate. You know, you're going to find all these questions that these people are going to have. If you pitch in a potion, lotion, a pill, if you pitch in health, wealth and riches, you want to type that keyword in cover and you'll find a bunch of people asking the questions. Now, this is your goal as an entrepreneur at the beginning stages. That's the site to do it on. Find out how to help a person. So if you go to the site, you say, hey, what's the problem that everybody got? The problem that everybody have is leads. So I would put leads in cover and I would get all these questions about people asking leads. I don't know how to get leads at this beginning stage when I was a beginner. So I don't know how to get leads. Right. And you probably be in the same position. So how are you going to find out to get leads? You go to YouTube and you type in YouTube. How do professionals, how do professional business owners get leads from YouTube? You want to put it in like that because anything else guru information going to come up and to further filter out the guru information you want to click on the filter sign and then you want to click videos for more than 20 minutes so you're not running across a people bunch of people trying to pitch you offers that you haven't created yet right <laughs> and so when you do those things go and watch one of those album long videos on how to get leads so when i first started i said craigslist how do professionals use craigslist to pull in leads that's what I put on YouTube. It bought me a bunch of videos that was asking people that was trying to get me to sell a bunch of um, trying to get me to buy a bunch of Craigslist products and services. Right. So I put the 20 minute mark and now all the videos is above 20 minutes. Now, these are videos of people teaching how to get leads on Craigslist to professionals. I watched a couple of those videos. I went and tested it on Craigslist. And I knew exactly how to get leads. Wow. And so then I went to Cora. Right. And I put Craigslist. I put, I'm sorry. I put leads. And, and sure enough, how do you get leads? I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't traffic, whatever the case may be, right? I'm putting in these keywords in Corvus so I can get these questions answered. Now, when I go answer the question for the person, I don't go and try to answer the question for the person and expect that person to buy from me. You still, you, if, you still, if you go on the, these websites doing the same thing that you've been doing all this time, acting desperate for money, hustling, thinking that your hustle game is going to change your finances, then you are operating in the wrong zone. You've been hustling your whole life and you're still at the point of desperation. Stop doing it. What you want to do is put together a formula that brings in a predictable result from a process that you created. And if you can do that, then you're not going to be hustling no more. You're going to understand the formula to get money. All right. So you go on Cora, you answer the question in the most intelligent way that you know how. And you know how to do this because you just took the training on it. Make sense, guys. And then for more, if you want, if, if and then let the and then don't write call to action on Cora. Just let the organic thing happen. And what's going to happen on Cora, right? There's so many people on this website. There's more people on this website than it is on Google. Asking questions about problems they have. You understand what I'm saying? When you go on this website, it's going to teach you. I mean, so it's going to show you the it's going to show you people that got that have the problem that you have. So what you do on the site is that you validate your offer. You tell the people how to do the problem. Like literally everything you tell them, right? You don't tell them what to do. Like you don't you don't break down the how to. You just tell them how what to do, <laughs> what to do to solve the problem, and then you let it sit there. You don't put a call to action. You just you don't put none of those things because Corver then, if that question is is satisfactory to the person that you answered it from, Corver then sends every single person that got that question on their site to your post so you can literally get 
you know, 20 people to 20,000 people literally, ain't, I'm sorry, looking for the solution to your question. People are going to reach out to you, asking you for, for help. And if you don't have a valid, if you don't have an offer to put into the person that asked you for help, this is what I got. This is what it does for you. This is how you can get it. Do you want it? And they can't say yes and pay you money. Then you're then that's that's the problem. Okay, so you want to make sure you got that offer, put it in front of that traffic, and you get it. All right. Another traffic source. Um. Let me say this first because I don't want to confuse you, right? And so that's the that's the principle of the matter. The principle of the matter is that if you start really trying to help people by learning something that's going to help another person, then you're really going to start making money. You start where you are. What's your problem? What is your problem right now? My problem is that I can't get no leads because I can't make no money. That's your problem. So if that's your problem, go on YouTube and find out how professionals get leads. You don't have to go and get leads and go and and and, and become a lead master so you can become a millionaire from it. You just need to learn something simple. Or you go go teach another beginner on how to solve the problem. If you don't know how to create an offer, that's your problem. That's the that's the next problem that you're going to solve on YouTube. Then you want to learn how to do that. You see what I'm saying? So all the barriers that you're facing, you're just facing them because you're limiting yourself to the gifts that's already available to you. Once you learn these things, then you're going to understand how to get money, right? And what am I saying learn these things? What does what does that mean? That means once you learn how to start helping people get everything they want and stop being desperate in your situation needing everything you want then you'll start getting money and until that happens it won't happen and so you know that's that's for my beginners here i am in my each intermediate stage and across the five hundred thousand dollar mark i'm trying to get to a million dollars a year right and so here's the thing with that being said i'm trying well we're about to throw these campaigns out in the marketplace we have a validated offer we have the power triangle system which is a life systems model when you put this model into your life, you're going to have unlimited business credit. You're going to have unlimited cash flow. And we're going to show you how to grow all that money into prosperity. So you have unlimited assets or cash flow assets growing you more cash. OK, so that's the gist of the whole process that we're building. We're going to take this offer and we get ready validated. How am I going to validate my offer? Well, it's already been validated <laughs> by the per- people, by me saying, hey, this is what I got. This is what it can do for you. This is how you get it. And people bought with their credit card and said, okay, Larry, that sounds good. I want it. Let's go ahead and rock. Now, this product has not been designed and people are paying me between $100 and $1,000 for it right now. It's not even ready yet. Why am I getting paid for it? Because I'm telling people this is where I am and this is where I'm going at. And if you are right here with me, we're about to walk it to the same place. That's exactly what's happening in my business right now. Okay. And it's working. And that's what I need you guys to understand is that you don't have to go figure out someone else's issues. You can actually start where you are because there are people right there where you are. But until you start building a tribe of people that you are teaching, you will always be wanting money. You're always going to be traveling and I'm sorry, hustling for cash flow. You got to remember the person on the stage makes the most money. This is my podcast, guys. We about to jump into these really good traffic um, sources, right? One of the traffic sources, I mean, not the traffic sources, traffic strategies that we're about to do. So I'm about to break down um, the, the 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 systematic process that I'm about to walk my team through when it comes to getting traffic. And that systematic process is a worksheet that we're going over, right? The first item on the worksheet is our is our target market like who are we actually serving all right and so one of these things that i do is that i don't market to the problem of the person i market to the nature of the human all right and so in human nature based on what i'm selling i'm in the financials market i know i am because i'm teaching money and how to grow money and i teach marketing and sales i know marketing and sales i'm a master at that so i don't have to teach that i can just tell that makes sense <laughs> okay and so um, if I'm teaching money, I'm in the financial markets, then I know there are five things that human beings care about more than they care about anything else. One of those things is their spirituality. That's a human nature, right? You're, you're, there's so many humans that love 
the spirituality, the universe, God, things of that nature. Then another person going to care more about their finances. People care about money more than they care about anything else because they believe money will keep them happy or keep them from from being unhappy. <laughs> I'm going to say it like that. Right. The third.